Hi, folks. How you doing? This is 8 News. Oh, man. I went to the grocery store today. Yeah, I didn't really see that much inflation, technically. Maybe my cheese was $9 a pound, but... Yeah, maybe I did. But it was Boar's Head, so... And it was at Publix. So, who knows if you're in being inflated at Publix, to be honest with you. Their prices are already, already inflation, so... I went to, got some groceries, um, oh, maybe, I can see some inflation in there when I was there. I usually get, uh, these chips that were used to be $2 a bag, and now it's two forty nine, Which, you know, it's not highway robbery, but, to be honest with you, I, I need to pay attention to the ounces in the chips. It could be lower, you know, a, a smaller bag, but, but right now I can deal with it, but, uh, kind of saddening for people who can't. I wish there could be something out there to help people with this inflation, but uh, it's going crazy, but I advise you to get your stuff at uh, Walmart if you want to try to cut inflation. Here's another uh, thing you can do when to cut inflation. Go to Big Lots and go to their clearance rack. Usually when you can get chip, kettle chips for $2 off the clearance rack, Sometimes you can get it for 65 to 75 cents. So, if you're looking for chips, you know, soups, stuff like that, if you don't mind a dented can and use it for a day, you can get it for like maybe 25 cents to 30 cents at Big Lots in the clearance se section. And, uh, you know, that can save you some money and have a meal for under 50 cents or 70 cents. You never know. You get It doesn't hurt to look. If you're in that area, just go into Big Lots, go to the food section. Big Lots has good deals on stuff when you need it. Also, when you're on um, Amazon, you can just search and search and search. And sometimes you find good prices, sometimes you find inflated prices. So it's just you have to keep on looking. And then, you know, just see if you're going to use it. If not, you can use it for some other day. So you just get one that's cheap and then get a couple boxes of it. If it's something you used to use and you still like it, get it. Uh, Walmart is a good place. Target, Target Super Centers, their food is pretty darn good. Try that out. When dixies a hit or miss if you're in Florida. When dixies really a hit or miss. Publix is, always has quality food in there. And uh, you're paying exorbitant amount of prices for their food. But I kind of like Publix because you know you're getting fresh deals. You know, fresh shot, not deals, but fresh stuff. Um, Win Dixie is the same way, hit or miss. And um, Walmart, Super Centers, hit or miss. Target's pretty good. Uh, we used to have Food Lion down here. That was a good deal. Win Dixie has some good deals on meat. Sometimes when it doesn't sell, they mark it down really price to sell. And uh, pretty good meat. Pretty good meat if you're using it that day. Anywho. I'll talk to you later, ladies and gentlemen. I hope this helps you out a lot. I'm going to come out with some instant savings and instant uh, things you need, you can do and anything in your budget so you can support yourself in these hard times. Talk to you later.